Hello everybody. I hope you're well today. Seems there's a lot of disturbing things going on in the news. The most disturbing ones I'm getting are reports of, of earth changes. The earth's always been changing, but uh, talk about a point see uh, rivers turning red like the Yangtze China and other rivers in Europe rivers turning red see earthquake clusters larger numbers than have ever been recorded happening fault lines giving off steam in California. It's an interesting article. I'll put links below to some of these things. You know, all the fish kills and animal die-offs we've been having in the last couple of years. All these things are all related. They're all related. Sinkholes popping up all over the place. Yeah. I'll leave a link to a fellow who can explain why all this is happening with uh, the earthquakes and the stuff like that, uh, scientific explanations. I believe it's on the ground. Some of you have probably heard of him. Scott Bug, believers underground. Um, post glacial rebound. All this water from all this glacial melt, such as Greenland, the Arctic, both poles, all that water is weight. You ever pick up a gallon of water, you know what I mean. You're talking about billions of tons of water being dumped into the oceans. This is cold water. All of its fresh water and dumped into a warm salty current coming up. That warm salty current slowed down thanks to BP. So now you got all this weight, changing weather patterns, causing the ground to do this as the oceans sink, kind of like that. In some places will, islands will be sinking. The water's not coming up, the island is sinking in. The, these things, the movements, we're fixing to have a major quake. I think it's going to affect most of the continent. So, uh, places to be on guard would be along the coasts, every coast, and along areas around fault lines. Those would be the places to try to avoid the most in the coming months. But if you can't get away from such areas, have your preparedness ready, have your emergency supplies and stuff ready. Maybe a while before anyone gets there to help you. And the help you get may not be what you want. So be ready. Um, all this red stuff, that's the blood of the earth. The earth is bleeding. Something down below has been fractured. pillars of the earth have been shaken. Soon, dominoes will begin to fall. Much like we're seeing in the economic world, you know that there's a problem when a country's police force are rioting. That's what's going on in Greece.
one domino falls. <coughs> How to stop the dominoes from falling, right? Once the chain reaction has begun. Good luck, everybody. Try not to be afraid of these things. Just be ready. Um, keep your mind upon the higher things. And remember to fight the violence with peace. Fight hatred with love. And a kind word turneth away a wrathful tongue. We're moving into different times. I can't say what it's going to be. I don't know what's going to happen. I can't tell the future. But I do have a, a manuscript that gives us an idea of what to prepare for. But it also says not to worry. God is with you, then it's going to be okay in the end, even if you die, because um, death's inevitable. Everybody dies. It's the second death you should be scared of, people. And that's the death of your spirit. And so many of you have already had your spirit slain. Christ can revive you, you know. Turn to Him. And, uh, good luck. Peace, love, and understanding. Uh, be with you all.